I'm going to show you in Fusion how to create a bolt. Very simple, easy to do in Fusion. So click on plus or click on create sketch, choose a work plane. I'm going to create a hexagonal or a polygon, hexagonal head. So go to polygon tool, start in the center, draw it up. And I'm going to make that diameter say six mil. So it's 12 mil from one side to the other. Finish that sketch. So this is a bolt which has a hexagonal head. Bolts have all sorts of different heads which you can experiment with. I'm going to extrude it to 6mm. Then again, sketch on the top of that surface and I'm going to draw a 6mm circle. I'm going to finish the sketch. I'm going to extrude it. I'm going to make it 40mm long. Again, very standard sort of sizes for our M6 bolt. All right. Um, then all you have to do, very simply, you've got a thread tool. Click thread, click the outside, and in the options that appear, choose model. And you see it automatically works everything out for you. This is why it's so easy on this software. Click OK, and you have a screw thread. Little things we could have done before we added that. We could have uh, modify chamfer, put a chamfer on the top. Just one mil, small chamfer, even less, that'd be fine. And then again, do it again. So thread, select the surface, modeled, and it works it out all for you. That's that. So obviously, you can do the same for a nut, and then you could assemble them. Yeah. I mean, you could also do little things like add more chamfers to the edge here, here. Yeah, you'll find if you look closely at, you have maybe very small, tiny chamfers like that. You may even have some bolts which have an Allen key head in it. So you could, uh, again, use the polygon tool. Polygon. And the top here, create another, say, 3 mil. So it's a 6 mil. And finish the sketch. And this time, put it down into the bit. So say, 5 mil. No, minus 5. There you go. Again, there might be a tiny little chamfer on objects like this. Easy. Uh, for a nut, it's just the opposite. So let's just open up a new design. Do it again. So again, using the polygon tool. I'll do the same, about six mil. You will draw a circle in the middle. In. So let's just dimension that. I lost the dimension tool. Make sure it's six. Finish the sketch, extrude. Distance, six. Okay. And then again, thread. This time it's an internal thread. Again, the software does it all for you. Easy. Probably not quite techni technically correct the size of that, but again for the simulation, yeah, that's fine. Add some chamfers. And the same on the bottom. Have a good.